Hi, welcome everybody. So uh, for those of you who don't know GSX, we provide monitoring, reporting, and management for uh, the services that you provide uh, to your end users, like messaging, collaboration, and uh, of course Office 365 as well. Uh, so our tools help to uh, help admins like you to have more control and visibility. And what I wanted to show you today is our brand new uh, interface uh, that we call Gizmo. So what you can see here uh, is all the monitoring uh, objects, all the platforms that you are responsible for. Uh, this is very flexible, so you can see the status uh, of uh, all the objects, all the entities, all the checks that you perform from one or multiple locations and for on-premise as well as uh, cloud services. So this, is, uh, this can be customized, so you can sort or filter uh, the different entities. So you can sort by any of the tags that we know of, like the location, the source, uh, the type of checks that is performed, or your uh, own uh, custom attributes if you want to. And you can sort as well, uh, for example, by the status. So here I want to focus on what's the most critical. Uh, so I've created some uh, specific views already for you. So uh, here, for example, I can group by the different platforms that we uh, monitor. So you can see here some on-premises. You can see some cloud uh, entities as well. So you can easily create a view just like this one uh, by our uh, custom view uh, creator. Uh, so here you can uh, just make a snapshot of what you would have filtered and uh, sorted, or you can just create a custom view and choose uh, the different level of uh, visibility that you want to see. So maybe you want to group first by uh, platforms like I've done here, uh, or maybe you want to group by location to understand the services, how they're delivered in uh, North America as opposed to EMEA and APAC. So it's really easy. You can focus on specific platforms. So here, for example, my Office 365 view, I can see the Skype for Business in different location, Exchange, but I can also see what will impact that service, uh, such as the ADFS, ADFS proxy. Uh, so you can really have different views so that everybody can uh, have visibility on the services that he's responsible for. Uh, you can see here as well the by location. Uh, we have uh, different what we call robot users that you can deploy in multiple locations that will provide a true visibility on the end user experience in these specific uh, locations. So then in terms of uh, troubleshooting, so uh, if something is wrong, uh, obviously you would receive an alert. You can come in here and what we want to allow you to do is to uh, be able to drill down and have access to uh, what's causing the error. So let's take a look here, for example, at Escape for Business. I can see there are some issues in the scenarios. I can see the different checks. So here I'm doing a login, uh, and the login is failing. So here I can have directly the issue. The sign-in action has uh, aborted, uh, looks invalid. I can see here the email address is, uh, is wrong, obviously. Uh, let's go back, take another example. So most of the time, what you're going to have is some performance issues. So some end users are going to call help desk and say, hey, it's uh, very slow. So what does it mean it's slow? Well, here you have some good performance indicators. So here I see, yes, indeed, in this location, there are some performance degradation on the network. You can see all of the checks that are performed, but there's one specific issue on the DNS resolution. It's exceeding the normal time that it takes usually, so I'm gonna most likely see some impact on the end users. And this is why we also provide graphs over the past few days. Uh, here you can see the evolution of the efficient time for the scenarios. And let's take a closer look at the DNS resolution. You can see information for the past few days. You can zoom on a specific uh, area. So here you can see uh, there has been some increase. Uh, so this might be explaining why some users have a call in help desk. So all of this in a modern uh, web browser uh, showing you real-time status over all the services that you're responsible for uh, with easy drill down and graphs that can show you all the information that you need. So thanks a lot for watching. Uh, we're excited to reel this on November 15th uh, of this year. So hope to see you there. Thank you.